Hello and a warm welcome to Coursal Estate Holiday Cottages and welcome to our new coffee machine. So let's get started on making a decent brew. Firstly check the coffee bean situation and add fresh beans to the hopper here. There's already quite a few there so I'm just going to top up there. Uh, you can um, add pre-ground coffee to the little hatch here if you prefer and if you want to adjust the bean grind to suit your tastes um, from coarse to fine adjust it using this knob here actually when the beans are being ground then make sure there's enough water in the water tank by pulling out the tank at the side here and topping up in here there we go, just a bit of water there And it slides in and out quite easily. Again, the machine will tell you if it's running low um, with a red flashing light. Now, grab a cup. This isn't the one that I'm going to use to make the cup of coffee. And pop it under the coffee nozzles. As the machine will soon send water through the system to heat up the pipes. And putting a cup underneath stops the tray getting too full of water. Switch the coffee machine on here. And it will start to warm up and will indicate when it's ready to, to make the coffee when it stops flashing. So shortly the water will come through. And now you're ready to choose what sort of cup of coffee you would like. You can choose an espresso, a double espresso, a half mug or a full mug. So I'm going to choose oh, this one here, but you can also adjust the strength of the coffee using this dial here. And we like it just off, slightly off um, the centre towards the right. <laughs> And that noise was the noise of the beans being ground. There's the coffee coming through. And you can adjust the nozzle here according to the size of your cup. So I could push it down a bit. There we go. And that is a beautiful cup of coffee. But you might want a latte or a cappuccino. And in which case you can use this steam wand here. Um, it has a little collar on it, um, and if you have it down, um, you can make a frothy cappuccino and up for hot milk. So I'm going to go for the cappuccino option. Um, and to get it working, press this little steam button here. Actually, before I do, the water um, indicator has come on. So I'm going to top up the water. to roll right press the steam um, I've got a little jug of milk here already prepared and it will it's ready when this starts flashing again right it's flashing so I'm going to turn this dial here to one do mind out because it is pushing hot steam through the wand Turn it off now because it's as frothy as I want. So 
and turning it clockwise back to zero. There we go. And here is my cup of coffee with lovely hot milk. There are a few cleaning procedures that would be grateful if you could carry out during your stay. Um, and the first thing is just to clean the, the milk wand. Oops, using a dry cloth. Um, and to empty um, the tray by pulling it out here. And the coffee grinds go in here. So this just comes out and you can give that a rinse. Um, every so often. Thank you very much.